My name is Erden Eruch. I am an outdoor athlete, accomplished ocean rower. I did not have any open ocean experience before I took on the circumnavigation. There was a map on the wall with America's on the right. Well, I traced my finger across that. I asked, what if could I do this by human power? And that became a quiet obsession. These roads and oceans and mountains will always be there. What gives them meaning is the effort that we put in to get there. I using a bicycle where I pedal or I walk or I see kayak. Any means that would enable me to move my body under my own power. So I'm propelling myself around the world. I became the first person to have rowed the three oceans, the first solo circumnavigation by human power, first mainland to mainland crossing from Australia to Africa. It's a total of 15 Guinness World Records. The lesson is don't quit, don't give up. And just when you think that 15 is enough, well, Erden wants more. So I'm on my way to Everest now. I need to get across the big pond called Pacific Ocean. I spend time in a sailing boat in the ocean, but it's definitely bigger than this. I just imagine how the big waves are hitting this and how you're feeling on this. When waves come, this boat lifts and stays on top of the waves. It's not like the bigger vessels with a lot of inertia where the waves climb the sides and rush across the deck. And this is my cabin. This is where all the electronics live. As you can see, the space is pretty small, but it pretty much has everything he needs to survive in the ocean. So if I have things under control and I can keep the pace, it could be done in three, four years, breaking my own record of fastest circumnavigation by human power, which stands at five years, 11 days now. It's not easy.